And hello YouTube, JS Man, I'm Smart here today with another brand new tutorial in Adobe InDesign. In today's tutorial, we're gonna show you how to change the styling of a set of words or a single word. Uh, for example, the words chapter one, chapter two, uh, chapter four. Throughout this document, we have the text say chapter with a number after it. Right now, all of it is bold and we're using a certain font. But if we wanted to go back now after we've written everything and say, okay, I don't, I don't really like how chapter and the number looks bold. If we wanted to change that font, maybe make it a little bigger. How do you change it all without going line by line and manually changing? I mean, we only have a seven page document, but if you have a 20 page magazine or newspaper or something like that, and you wanted to change every place that it says chapter, what would you do? Well, what you can do is go to, up to edit, go ahead and go to find slash change and then you'll be able to uh, type into find what here so we'll type in chapter because we're looking for the words chapter but now what about this number here the number is different every time it's chapter one chapter two chapter three chapter four how do we capture that go ahead and press the space bar here uh, to have a space there and then on the right side here you have a little uh, symbol here for special characters go down to wild cards click any digit and that will basically say look for any place that has the words chapter with a space and then a number after it this basically tells indesign some number and then what we'll do is we'll go to the change format section here if you don't see these two sections here find format and change format you can go click the more options button here if it doesn't say fewer options and then under change format here, the right side has a little symbol here. Go and click that. And then you'll tell InDesign, okay, every place where we're looking for chapter space number, go ahead and change this to um, this font, make it bold italic, and maybe make it size 14 point font. There are several other options here you can fiddle around with. And once you're done that, make sure you have your search set to document. If you have it set to, to end of story, story, or even just selection, um, then it won't see it won't scan the whole document. Go ahead and press document, make sure that's selected. And you also make sure that if you did highlight something, your cursor is somewhere, you wanna make sure you're going forward. If your cursor is all the way at the end of your document, you wanna make sure you're going backwards. Um, and then once all that is set up, go ahead and click change all. And you'll see right, right now, chapter two looks like this. Go ahead and click change all. It'll say it found six places where it found chapter space number. Press OK. And you'll see we can press done here. And now every place that it says chapter one, chapter two, as you can see, every instance now the font has changed, the size has changed, and you're pretty much good to go. So a simple quick fix to changing the style of any piece of text. Um, in a whole document. If you found the video helpful, go ahead and leave a like. If you have questions, leave a comment down below. And we got plenty of other tutorials on InDesign, Premiere Pro, video editing, uh, audio editing on the channel. So if you haven't checked those out, go ahead and check them out. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.